I'm making this video because so many people requested it. In my tutorials, I already shared several times that oftentimes I start the beginning of the row with a beginning double crochet. And I showed how I make it. However, many people have trouble understanding how exactly to wrap the yarn around the hook. So they keep asking me to make a detailed tutorial. And that's what I'm doing today. And I will be demonstrating on my current project. This is what I'm working for. I got a commission to make this lacy scarf with flowers. So here I am at the beginning of the row, which I need to start with a double crochet. And usually in patterns, three chains are used for that purpose. So you start with three chains, but you count these three chains as a double crochet. However, another way to do it is to make a beginning double crochet which is gonna look like this. That's a beginning double crochet. And that's what I'm going to show you in great detail. So I'm gonna undo the one that I made and I'm actually going to pull up the loop much higher like this one. So you can clearly see and understand how to wrap the yarn around the hook. So you keep the loop on the hook and with your middle finger, you hold the yarn to the hook so that the loop does not slide on the hook. You don't want it to slide like this. So you keep it in place and then you're going to wrap this loop around your hook. And here is how you do it. Like this. That's how you get the yarn over. Now I'll make this loop smaller so I can actually show the stitch itself. Here is how much I pulled the yarn loop. It should be slightly higher, slightly taller than what you expect your double crochet to be. So in my case right here, it's about half an inch. So with my middle finger, I hold the loop on the hook so it doesn't slide and then I wrap it around my hook. Then I insert the hook into the stitch. I pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over and finish my double crochet. And here I have my beginning double crochet. 